What would one think of life if we existed in two planes? A vast universe created and pondered by creators of time, trapped in an eternal bubble that sets costs to shrink within all we knew. No matter hither or yonder, we had no clue until the first dots connected in endless euphoria, thus bringing life's consequential birth to the shrine. A kingdom cased away in a void unbeknownst to us, by the name of Vagala Infinity, in the realm of Hitherfall. It was said to have created worlds beyond stars, life that had lived many times over, harnessing their studies inside the most powerful archive of knowledge, what we'd come to know as the Iris, knower of all pasts, presents, and futures, the ultimate vessel of all-encompassing intelligence. It would record every birth and every death of our planetary glacier, all for the protection against an imploding wonder. But its infamous testament was not without surprises. The Iris Archive held vaster powers to manipulate our drifting void. It was also what kept who and whatever possessed it out of the yonder. That yonder being a realm devoid of hitherfall known as Yondrathal. Every living life force remained here, while souls of those passing on would pass through to hitherfall. Six cosmic beacons were created, and their light would be what expands the bubble we know, never letting eternal damnation shrink inwards. Many millennia had been put into these dancing stars, and as stars ignited, so did their devastating collapse. Tale for tales of these systems living many a life over, all recorded through the Iris archives, each cycle becoming stronger than before. Of course, that's all anybody knew. Not a soul had considered furious eruption from beyond the bubble, until one day, thus Vegala Zero was born. It begs the question, what happens when you live life on the edge? You get havoc. An adrenaline pierces through the bubble we're all too familiar with, and opens up a freight train with no direction. Two planes hanging in balance, one that only the crazier than fiction can muster. On this day of havoc, we celebrate what happened when a deprived source of all knowledge is spread across the vastness we remain inside. We bear witness to an origin jumping realms in the blink of an eye when its only protection is taken from them. Hither and yonder. Be ready for wonder. Open knowledge's gate. Stand. <laughs>